Hello guys, welcome back to Let's Play do, 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 do. Skyrim. Oh dear. Look at this. Nightingale bow. Lovely. Let's get on with it. Right. <laughs> when I last left off, oh, I'd failed in a miserable way. I'd picked up all of our stuff from our chest and I spent a long time putting it back. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, but we have a message for the Jarl. Hey, be quiet, you. We have a message for the Jarl. Yes, we do. And the uh, the message is something to do with something to do with joining sides. This always looks like an upturned boat to me. I don't know about you. Do you see that? <laughs> well, let's go to Dragon's Reach. Safe, I Certainly, I'm being staying safe, relatively. <laughs> Onwards, trying not to headbutt the that strange post in the middle of everything, in the middle of the doorway. Nobody noticed that. It's like there's a door either side of a post in the middle. But perhaps the all wanted something like that. I don't know. Right, come on, let's get up, see what he's got to say, if he's there. He certainly is. Is he getting advice from the people? Let's have a chat. Hello there, y'all, I've got a message. I have an important message from General Tullius. I don't know how many times? <laughs> <laughs> but Ulfric plans to attack Whiterun, and the general wants to send legion troops. Give the papers to my steward. Uh, I was given strict instructions for the Jarl's eyes only, though. Don't be daft. Prevent assist my eyes. Just give me the letter. I presume once I have it, I can do as I please with it. Good. Good. <clears throat> These are interesting reports. Okay. What do you make of all this? Do you think about well, it? Just wait, see. wait and see. Pray, wait. Exactly. It's time to act. Exactly. Yes. I'm not a fool, Preventus. I mean, it's time to challenge Ulfric to face me as a man. Or to declare his intentions. I do such a thing. What? He was rather straightforward as a Tory. Tory? He simply walked up to the boy and murdered him. That act boy was a high king of Skyrim. Yeah, that was a problem. I am not a high king. But neither am I a boy. If Ulfric wants to challenge my rule in the old way, let him. Though I suspect he'll prefer to send his. Storm cloaks to do, do it for, for him. True, he's, he's already proven his personal strength. Now, now he seeks to prove his armies. Then, then might I urge you to consider General Tullius' request. I mean, I mean if you, you are bent on offending your Ulfric. Ulfric is the one who has offended. Exactly, yes, he is. But Ventus has a point. Ulfric has made it clear in his mind to refuse his claim to side the Empire. Hmm. And what harm is there letting a few legionnaires die places your own men? It is a good point. It seems cowardly. Was it cowardly, cowardly then to accept the white, white gold, gold concord? This is a That was different. Was, was I given, given a chance, chance to object to the terms of the treaty? treaty? No. no. The Yarls weren't asked. asked. We, were we were told. told. And we, we had, had to like it. it. The chest of gold did it hurt. Damn it. This is about cold. It's, it's time, time to decide. Lord, Lord wait. wait. Let, Let us see if Ulfric is serious. serious. Oh, he's serious. But so am I. Finally. You there. Me. I have a message for you to deliver to our friend, the esteemed Jarl of Windhelm. What? Me. This axe to Ulfric Stormcloak. Me? No, no, not me. 
If that dude is a racist, he hates me. He will want to kill me. <laughs> An axe? What? What? Oh no, no. Don't get me into trouble. I, no. Don't get me into trouble. I don't want to get into trouble. Oh. What's this axe? How long, How long have you been, been in Skyrim? Skyrim? Yes. yes. Give, Give the man, man my axe. If, if he returns, returns it to you, it means we have business to settle. If he keeps it, then, then we are, are at peace. peace. Right, and should I say anything to him? Men who understand one another need not waste words. There are but a few simple truths behind one warrior giving another his ass. Ulfric will know my meaning. Uh, well, very well. Very well. And, um... Well, I suppose I'll get on with it, really. Good. Good. What... Preventus, bring me my pen, and a good parchment. Now, now it's only mine. Hmm, right. Um, weapons at the ready, check. Let's check what he gave us. The Jarl's axe. Nothing significantly looking about it, aside from the fact that it is the Jarl's axe. So we're off to Windhelm, of all places. <laughs> to hand the weapon, the axe, of um, the Jarl of Whiterun to Ulfric Stormcloak. Oh dear. Oh dear. This could only go badly. It's alright, it's alright. If it does turn badly, we'll do the most... Um, well, we'll do what we always do, and run away. <laughs> Run away as fast as we possibly can. Right, and let us get the map. Oh dear me, you are off to Windhelm. I don't really want to go to Windhelm. I'm off to see the king. <laughs> well, he's not the king, is he? He's. Is he? Oh, I don't know actually. Is he the king? Well, he's Ulfric Stormcloak, that's one thing for certain. Last time we saw him, he was chatting to his friend. We didn't actually speak to him, though, I don't think. So let's see if he treats us well. Right, here we are. Let us move forwards. And in. Hey, you're the one. What? I don't know what she's talking about. Right. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Hi there. Yes. yes. Make, Make it quick. quick. I brought a message from the Yarl of White Run. Is that so? I've been wondering when we come around. Oh, what's, what's this? this? Uh, you're, you're quite ready to carry such a message. message. It's, it's a pity you've chosen, chosen the wrong side. side. You, you can, can return, return this axe to the man who sent it, and, and tell him he should prepare and entertain this is this. I expect, I expect a great, great deal of excitement in the city of White, White Run in the near future. future. Oh dear. Oh dear. Um. Well, we'll be seeing you then, my friend. Soon, then, you think. If he's not with us, he's just against us. Okay. Looks like whatever... Whatever is happening... Oh, sounds like... Oh, well, I don't know, but it sounds bad. <laughs> Let's... No, why am I pressing that button? It's the M button for the map. Right. Back to White Run, then, I suppose. Oh, dear. I suppose we go directly to Dragon's Reach. Yes. Oh, all this nasty business. We didn't spend very long speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak. We just sort of, um, well, said we have a message. Here's the axe. The guy's like, whoa, we're pretty brave doing that. I'm presuming it's some sort of declaration of war, perhaps. I don't know really. Well, anyway, it wasn't a good sign, and it didn't look like he was very pleased. So it looks like we've got an attack coming our way. 
So hopefully we can get back before the armies do. I think we can move faster than an army, so we'll be alright. But uh, I think we'll have to deal with an awful lot of violence. But we'll see if we can put our sneak to good use. Sneak around. Probably do sneaky arrow shots. Um, and I think if we're going to do sneaky arrow shots, we'll go back home and pick up the that helmet that gives us 25% plus attack for archery. That's a good idea. Right, let's see wait, wait. what our, the Jarl has to say. Our lovely Jarl friend. <laughs> oh no, there's all the sorts of war going on and it's violent and it's upsetting and people are getting angry at each other and it's all, it's all complicated. Oh dear me, Ulfric should just keep calm. But he's not going to, is he? Right. Here we are. Look at that dragon skull up on there. Where's the Jarl? Has he gone to bed? My cousin's out fighting dragons. What do I get? God, Judy, well, you should be pleased about that. What are these books? Did I not pinch all of these books? What's happening? Take a moment to breathe, soldier. But, sir, breathe. What's happening? Right, come on then, let's speak to Ulfric. Not Ulfric. Um, Balgruff. You returned with my axe. I knew that would be his response. As soon as you left, I sent word to General Callius, who's been kind enough to lend us some of his troops and Lake Sipius here. Oh, that's good. Ulfric tried to make it past our combined forces. I'll turn you back over to your legion. Legacy will have use for you. God be with us all. Okay, so he's. I presume he's took the axe. Yes, he took the axe. And we need to speak with Quentin Scipius. Alright, so why do you think the Ulfric killed the High King? No doubt, he thought it was the only way to make his point. And also, because he knew he could. Wow, okay. And, um. Think what will what do you think will it'll take to stop this war? Okay. Okay, that's sounds like a megalomaniac. <laughs> Looks like we sided with the right side here. And now he's a racist. Right, so, um. That's. Well, that's all we really need to talk to. With him, but. So, he wants to take my city. Yeah. Hmm. The men will be fighting in flanks. Hmm. Let's have a little word with you, sir. Wait, I know you. Yeah, you do. Of course you do. I don't know. Are you making a mistake? No mistake. You're a wanted man, and it's, it's time, time to pay, pay your price. What are you talking about? Um, hang on a minute. I can pay off my what? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. <coughs> I can pay off. I've got. Hang on a minute. I can say I'm with the guild and pay two hundred and seventy-nine gold. Or oh, I can say you caught me and pay 25 gold. I wonder if that pays off all the debts we've got everywhere. Uh, I'm just going to gamble on it and s and say that I'm with the guild. Right. Hey. What? You're making a mistake. No mistake. You're You're a man. Man. What is going on? Are you joking? What are you doing? Uh, okay. I'll pay the bounty. What's good, good enough? I'll, I'll just, just confiscate, confiscate any stolen, stolen goods, goods you're carrying. Carry. Then, then you're free to go. go. What is going on here? Uh, can I report in now, sir? Bong-eyed rascal of a doofus brain. 
What's wrong with you? The storm looks in force. Get down to the front line. This is it. We must hold the city. All right. Got some war. Brilliant, brilliant. We've got lots of war to do. Lots and lots of war. Lots and lots of war. Ha ha. Lovely. Brilliant. I tell you what, we're going to save up here. Um, but when we come back, guys, it's going to be more Skyrim. War is a coming, and we are going to do what we need to do. Whew. And that'll be for then. Okay? So until then, guys, stay safe, take care of yourself. Goodbye.